Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September 23rd of 2022. Well, it is titled ringed ice giant Neptune. So what do we see here? Well, here is an image from the James Webb Space Telescope looking in the infrared part of the spectrum and looking at the outermost planet in the solar system, which is Neptune. Now we can see some of the details here, but one of the interesting things we can see about it are it is it are sorry is its ring system. All of our giant planets have ring systems. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune all have a ring system. And this is the second time we've really been able to see the ring system of Neptune. And that's simply because it is very difficult, very faint to see and hard to detect from Earth. And the last time it was actually seen was August of 1989, when the Voyager 2 spacecraft flew out past Neptune, our only visit to the ice giant planet on the outer edge of the planets of the solar system. And that was when we discovered the rings and then we have not been able to really see them again until now. So now with the Webb Space Telescope, we have a chance to be able to study these rings again. Now the rings aren't all we see. We also see some of the structures on the surface. The outer two planets, Uranus and Neptune, are very bland in appearance compared to Jupiter and Saturn. But here in the infrared, we can see some different structures and a little bit of signs of the banding of the clouds that we are familiar with with the inner giant planets. And around we also see what look like you may think are a number of stars, but actually much of what we see here are some of the moons of Neptune. So we can see several moons here, including the large moon Triton, which is the bright object up to up above and slightly to the left of Neptune. It is very bright because of the frozen nitrogen that coats its surface, making it extremely bright in the infrared where James Webb is imaging. And we can also see a number of the other objects also around there are also part of the ring system and the moon system of Neptune. And in fact, within this image, you can see a number of those moons. Seven of the 14 are actually visible in this image. So you can see half of Neptune's known moons. And there are probably a lot more that we do not know about because of the distance to Neptune and the lack of exploration by spacecraft. So perhaps the Webb Space Telescope through future observations will even find a few more moons to add to that collection. So that was our picture of the day for September 23rd of 2022. It was titled Ringed Ice Giant Neptune. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be shadows in the sky. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.